Hello again, I'm Martin Reynolds and welcome to another video review. Today I'm looking at the Cooled Eco Advanced Liquid Cooling CPU Cooler. What's included with the main unit is a quick installation guide, back plates for the socket 1366, 1156 and 775, as well as brackets for AMD sockets and four screws. This product is compatible with all current AMD and Intel motherboards, but note how easy it is to install on Intel sockets. As you can see here, there's labeling for the socket 1366, 1156, and 775. And all you would need to do, whether you're installing it on either one of these sockets, is pull out, and then all you need to do is readjust it. 1156, pull it again, and push and it's 2775 and you do that with each of these and you can see how easy it would be to attach this sealed liquid cooling system is completely sealed off so there is no maintenance required and this means no refills are required and no risk of leaks since it's completely configured there's no need for any extra installation like many other liquid cooling kits by combining the water block pump reservoir and radiator together, it reduces the traditional four component loop into just one component. This substantially decreases space required for installation and it really simplifies the installation process over traditional water cooling setups. The pump, water reservoir, cold plate, as well as the electronics are housed in one compact unit and the pump that's used is ultra quiet and designed to last for many years. The CPU block is all copper and has a great finish so it will make excellent contact between it and the CPU. The block also comes with a thin coat of thermal compound which takes the guesswork out of applying it yourself. Note that there's only one power connection and this three pin connection can be connected on any three pin motherboard fan header. The corrugated tubing that's used is much less porous than vinyl tubing or even rubber and hence fewer refills are required. It also doesn't crack or deteriorate easy. The downside to this corrugated tubing is it is not as flexible as vinyl or rubber tubing. And note how well that this corrugated tubing is attached. So you do not have to worry about it coming detached and thus you do not have to worry about leaks. The 120 millimeter radiator that's included has lots of fins and a quiet 120 millimeter fan. This fan comes with a four pin connection and this would actually be connected onto the motherboard's CPU fan header. Installation is very easy. First attach the water block and then mount the main unit at the back of the case where a 120 millimeter fan would normally be installed. Note that all the materials for installation are included and it can be mounted on any new AMD or Intel based motherboard and will fit in most cases with a 120 millimeter fan at the back. Also, an optional additional 120 millimeter fan can be installed for added performance. Finally, have a listen to the pump and fan. If you're in the market for a CPU cooler, but you're really not sure what to go with, you're thinking maybe you should go with a really, really good air cooler, or possibly custom water cooling. Well, a product like this is certainly an option. It's in between. It gives you the ease of installation that you would find on a CPU air cooler, but also some of the performance you'd find in a custom water cooling kit. Overall, this is a kick-ass product. Until next time, take care.